All right, well, I'm here today with a little bit of a story for you, and this is going to be a rant. And I want to tell you right this moment that before you continue watching, if you are offended by strong language, stop watching right now. Like, right now. You have been warned. By the way, Marty, your uh, rant about YouTube couldn't have said it better. This platform is a disgrace. Kind of like this platform. Okay. So here's what happened. As you know, I'm a reseller. I sell on eBay and Marketplace. Don't even get me started on Facebook Marketplace. I mean, what a fucking nightmare. It's, it's absolute hell. I don't even know why I do it. And eBay is pretty much the same. So, I had an item which I sold uh, a couple weeks ago. First of all, when I was in St. Louis in March, many of you may not know, but basically, my laptop bit the dust, and so I had to go to the Apple store, and luckily, it wasn't the battery on the MacBook, it was the adapter. So I had to get a brand new MagSafe adapter for the MacBook. That was 75 bucks, plus tax, just for that. So anyway, actually it was like 79 bucks. Anyway, so I had the box for the uh, Apple MagSafe adapter. So I thought, you know what, I'm gonna list the box for sale on eBay. Because sometimes movie studios or TV shows like to buy the stuff for props and they don't have to buy the actual thing and just get the original box. So anyway, I sold it, got to the guy, and then I had a return request. And he said he wanted to return it and his reason was uh, ordered by mistake and he didn't realize it was only a box. Okay. Me and him had this big argument and whatever. That's beside the point. So he shipped it back. I refunded him. Then about a few days later, I relisted the fucking thing, and it got sent to a guy. I bought it uh, in Colorado. I swear it's going to rain any moment. It's been raining all day again. And when he got it, that same night it was delivered, I get a message. A buyer would like to return the item. So here's some paperwork. Let's take a look at this. Okay, together. If it's gonna focus, here we go. Reason, ordered by mistake. Did not realize it was only the box. Okay, now I just got this back today because this fucker sent it back, you know, whatever. Let me start with this. There's the title of the item. Apple MagSafe 60 watt AC adapter power charger A1. Three, four, four for MacBook, 13 inch, box only. Here's the listing, the actual listing. There it is. There it is, box only. Okay? That is the title. There is the description that I put on eBay. Apple MagSafe 60 watt AC adapter power charger A1344 for MacBook, 13 inch, box, insert, and manual only. Didn't realize it was only for the manual, I mean, only for the box. How much clearer do I have to fucking be? I put it in the title, in the description, and the photos showed a box. They did not show a charger. And remember, if you saw it, it was $16.98. The first time I sold it, I sold it for $15.98. That motherfucker thought he was getting a genuine Apple adapter for $15.98 shipped to California for free. The second guy thought he was getting a genuine Mac, uh, MacBook adapter for $16.98 shipped to Colorado for free. That's a $79 item. So here's our lovely correspondence. So as soon as I got that return request the second time, I was pretty angry. I knew I was gonna make a rant video. Because eBay is a joke. Facebook's pretty shitty too. Anyway, this is me. I want to know something very simply. You didn't realize this was just a box? Seriously? Don't you look at what you're buying? Good God. It said so in the title, description, and the photos. And for less than 17 shipped, you thought you were getting a genuine MacBook adapter? They go for 75 or more in store. I'm pretty frustrated here, and you are not the first individual to do this. What more should I be doing here? I mean, how much more clear can I make it? He responds, of course, these lovely buyers love to project. 
First, you should be more respectful of customers. By way of this response, I hope you never have to deal with people. Wow. That said, if others had the same issue, you may want to think about revising your title and description and how it's laid out. It says fucking box only in the title. Lastly, who in their right mind wants an empty box? Absolutely absurd. Real class act here. Real class act. So I respond, I love how individuals such as yourself turn and project this stuff to make it my fault. It said box only in the description, in the title, in the description, in the photos. Did he see an adapter? No. Oh, but I am the one who needs to do a better job on my listing. Right. You were the one who bought it. I didn't make you do that. I have many customers who probably shocking to you that I have customers purchase items like this for television or movies. Props. Because how else do you get an original box without buying the whole thing? Anyway, I'll refund you, but next time, maybe put two and two together before you buy something like this for the price of 17 bucks shipped. I did not see an adapter in the photos. He responds, I'm not blaming you. You asked me what you could do better. What a fucking piece of shit. A piece of advice. Relax. It's not a big deal. And, and it's starting to rain now, not too hard. I have our friend here today, the genuine Apple MagSafe power adapter box. He even has the original sticker on it. There is the box only. Now I did have the insert, but I recycled it. And it had the manual in the, in the sleeve, which I recycled. And here we have a crowbar or pickaxe. There's your box only, son of a bitch.